Hello friends, uh, this is Vilas Patil here. Welcome to my tutorials of uh, Hybrid Automation Technologies. Today I am going to show you how to program the timers and counters. In this tutorial, I am going to show the timers programming. Uh, first of all, uh, for programming and simulation in computer only, you need to uh, have these uh, three softwares, three supporting softwares. There is RS Logix 500, RS Lynx Classic Gateway, and RS Logix Emulate 500. Okay. First, uh, go to RS Lynx Classic and uh, go to Configure Drivers and click on the SLC Finder Emulator Driver here and click Add On, Add New. And you can rename it to anything or leave as it is also. Uh, also. But uh, here I am going to name it as a Demo driver 500 and click OK. And it is taking the station number 00. You can specify from 00 to uh, 31. Uh, I will keep it 00 only and click OK. Now it is running here. Now close from this uh, here and minimize this one. Now we'll do the programming in RS Logics 500. Later on, we'll see about the RS Emulate, RS Logics Emulate 500. Okay. Now uh, go to file menu and click on new in this wizard you can uh, put the uh, processor name here and you have to select the emulator driver here uh, this one right now I have created and select the <coughs> proper PLC here or I will select MacroLogix 1200 series C1 or B or 1 or 2 and click OK now uh, I will take a new run here. This is a parallel branch. Normally open, normally close contact. Okay. Now I will do a uh, this one um, conveyor programming here or a dual shutter program. You can say. In previous uh, tutorials, you have see, seen this. How to create this pro, uh, program? Just I am uh, pressing I for input and pressing enter continuously. It is taking the next address automatically. Okay. If you want to specify any description or uh, name for this uh, bits, input and output bits, you can type here. Conveyor. Okay. Okay. When we uh, click this button, start. Okay. When we uh, trigger this input, the conveyor is going to be on. And when we press the stop button or when you trigger this input, it's, it's going to be stopped. But uh, in it should be stopped after some time or uh, say 10 seconds. How to program the timer in this program? I will take another run here and I will take this uh, conveyor bit here. Uh, means storage bit I'm going to take here. Now go to timer. I will take a T on here. Okay, for timer uh, instructions, you have to specify the name as T4 or it is taking here timer, press enter. Okay, T4 colon 0, T4 colon 1, like this you can take. Okay, now uh, time base is also important. Okay, multiply the time which you are going to specify with this time base value, you are getting the time constant value. Okay. If I take a 0 0.01, I am going to I have to specify the preset value as a 500 here. In preset value, I am going to set as a 5 second. Okay, accumulator value shows the counted time here. Okay, now we have to take this done bit of this timer and place the normally close contact of this done bit here. Here I am going to taking the one normally close contact. And I will specify the T4 colon 0 
forward slash dn this is the done bit of a timer here okay now verify the file verify the project here and save this one okay save this one now go to emulator and click open and open the saved file here this is the saved tmr prg is the file here i am going to open it here and now we have taken the driver uh, station number as 00 i will take it as a 01 here okay now minimize this one now go to tools options go to communication you have to select the driver here also and click who active okay this is the driver which you have created and click on this this is the 01 virtual plc here select this one and click ok apply and ok now go to online and run ok now i am triggering this input here for soft here you can see 3, 4, 5. After 5 seconds, the done bit is going to be high and this normally close open, normally close contact is going to be open. So, conveyor is off. Means uh, the input of you know, timer is also off. Okay. Now I am going to. Uh, Change the preset time here to 10 seconds. Again, force on, release the force. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Here it goes. Okay. Done bit is on, means it, this contact is going to be open and our conveyor uh, is going to be stopped. Thank you, friends. Thank you for watching the program uh, and keep watching my videos and please subscribe to my channel and uh, Thank you.